Ah, another beautiful day on the nerd.nu Minecraft server. This is... Oh, there we are! <laughs> this is Grenbug! Hey, welcome again to my silly little channel here. Uh, play and paint, where we uh, do a little Minecraft and then uh, do a little drawing. So we are on our quest to gather some more flowers. We're going to get started here. Let me just turn on replay and it's raining. Great. <laughs> uh, we're just going to go for it. We can fly in the rain. Actually, that would be very cool to fly in the rain. I think I would really like it. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Uh, we did not fly. Why are, why are our rockets not working? Oh, Minecraft, you kill me sometimes. Here we go. Okay, okay, rockets are working. Does that mean I can take off? Yes, it does. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is so silly. I actually like this, flying in the rain. That's kind of nice. Okay, so here we are. We are out in the ocean. That was actually the mob uh, farm. That might be a good thing to uh, keep in mind, because as I fly around, I, I tend to go through a lot of rockets. Um, I get lost. Oh, oh, this is pretty. Oh, look at this. Oh, that's so pretty with the uh, with the paths and then the tall grass and the flowers and everything. That is so cool. And the cool thing about uh, getting distracted by things is I've run out of rockets. <laughs> Look at that, I'm down to two rockets. I also get lost a lot. I get lost a lot. So I fly around and fly around <laughs> looking for things. Yeah, we gotta resupply here. Give me just a second. Okay, we are all provisioned up. We got plenty of rockets. We are ready to go. Thank you to whoever uh, build this. I think it's Omega, maybe? Uh, <laughs> but they they added a great resource to the server here. So you can uh, fly in and build up, uh, build up a rocket supply. Now, I think over here is a uh, dark oak forest. And that's what I'm looking for, because where there's dark oak, there's also mushrooms. And that's what we need next for our quest. Okay, and now I'm just looking for a safe place to land. This is <laughs> not good. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Water I'll take a water landing. Water landing is good. <laughs> I'm still not good with Elytra. Uh it's a little, little scary for me. But uh, what we're going to look for now, there's plenty of the red mushrooms, but we need to find uh, some of the brown mushrooms too. So this area, either it's a little bit of a glitch or maybe somebody dug out all the sand and just left all the dirt because everything's kind of broken here. Oh, what's down? Oh, an exposed cave. Now this is good. This is good because I need some of the cave things too. Um, do I go down here? Is there a safe? I think I have. Oh, oh, it's getting pretty close to dark, but I think I have enough time to get down there and get back out. Let's give it a try. And thankfully there's water here, so it makes it much easier to just jump on down. And what I'm looking for is flowering. Oh, here it is, flowering azalea. So I'll get one of those. And then I need the plain azalea too. There's some over there. I just need a safe way to get over there. Just hop around. Yeah, let's see, is that, uh, no, that's moss. Okay, oh, here we go. There we go, okay. Okay, and I can see it's getting darker here. Let's put up a couple torches uh, just so we're not having mobs spawn right on top of us. And let's see here. Now we have to figure out how to get back out. Now, in theory, in theory, I can just fly out of here. That, that seems dangerous. <laughs> let's give it a try. Oh, I hate this. I hate this. Oh, that's so scary. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Okay, 
Let's see, we've got oh, plenty of mushrooms here. Okay, we are uh, getting very close to uh, nightfall, so I'm just going to grab a couple things and meet you back up at the base here. Okay, whew, we made it. We made it back safe. We did not die. That was very good. <laughs> So here we got all of our like foresty type of things and cave type of things. So we have our uh, flowering azalea. And those, look at how pretty these are. These are just, Mo Yang designed these perfect to go into flower pots. They just look so awesome. These are great. And we got our mushrooms. And, you know, they don't look quite as good as those azaleas. <laughs> and now we can get over to procreate. Now over in Procreate, so <laughs> I started at this drawing and I kind of, what I was going for was like kind of three different levels of mushrooms, you know, the little ones and then like a medium one that's growing up with the big ones in the back. And I, I kind of like the concept. I started going through it. It, it was going okay, but then I, I just, I didn't like some of the technique and my line work here. And this is part of the problem. I'm getting fussy. <laughs> I'm getting picky about how my art looks now. Uh, and I wanted this to be just a fun, whimsical project. So I had to remind myself, this is just for fun. So I was listening to a podcast uh, where the host uh, was talking about a temporary tattoo he had as a kid with a cobra that was on fire. And uh, I thought that would be perfect. That's like the perfect whimsical thing that I needed <laughs> at this moment to get this <laughs> little drawing done. And uh, there's my mushroom drawing with a cobra and he's on fire. <laughs> so there we are, my friends. What a funny little episode. <laughs> But hey, you know, it's fun to uh, make these and just get them out there. And uh, it's supposed to be a fun project. So thanks again for joining me. My name is Grenbug, and I appreciate you watching these goofy little videos with me.